My name is Yuri Suzuki, and I'm an artist in Greenville, South Carolina. One of the projects that I've done is called the Butterfly Project, and it took about five years to complete, and I just completed it last year. I wanted to utilize the symbol of the butterfly because the butterfly transforms itself. Greenville was a textile town. Now it's a city of advanced manufacturing, and I thought, what a great metaphor for the city of Greenville. Butterflies mean many things to many people. There's not a single person that I can think of that doesn't like a butterfly. I went to the city and I said, I'd like to create a installation piece where the whole city is the canvas. And I'd like to place butterflies on light posts and I'd like to place them on buildings so that when kids walk around or tourists walk around, they'll say, look, there's a butterfly. And that would be a wondrous thing because it would put a smile on the face. There's a sculpture called Butterfly Journey, and it's at the entrance of the Cancer Survivors Park. And to many cancer survivors, butterfly means hope, it means rebirth, it means the fragility of life. It means fighting for yourself to get out of that cocoon and to make yourself um, beautiful in any way that you are. I work in the medium of steel. Steel, when you think of it, you think of it being unbending and cold and very hard to, to destroy or to form. For me, it's a challenge, an interesting challenge, to make it into something that is very airy, that's something that seems to float, something that's fragile. I try to achieve that in the butterflies because it's almost ironic that a butterfly, which seems so gentle and beautiful and fluttering, is actually made out of steel. There are some butterflies made out of regular steel. There are butterflies that are made out of stainless steel. And there are some butterflies that I've powder coated blue. And I like the way that depending on the light, the color blue would change. It would, it would be almost iridescent. A typical day for me is I may go to the fabrication shop. And to me, it's ironic that from out of that noise and grit and dust that um, something beautiful comes out, especially a butterfly. It's almost as if out of this cocoon, this butterfly flutters out and um, it's magical.